Right. Hmm. Now it was nice to be to be back in the race and uh, yeah, feeling uh, yeah feels good to be back back racing. Was that like a classic style stage today? Yeah, I guess it was. To be honest, it was. Um, yeah, the start was was full full gas. I was in the big move and then it came back together and literally just as we set out this the, the next move went and I was just hesitated for one second and, and missed it. But then yeah, came across after the sprint and yeah, it just felt good to be to be racing. And you look around, I mean there were monument stars in there, cyclocross stars, classic stars, the true top guns of the Tour de France and the spring. Yeah, I mean um, there certainly were some guys with some kilos on me, that's for that's for sure. So it was, um, you know, needed a few bigger hills to play into my advantage today. But yeah, they, uh, yeah, like I said, it was nice to be to, to just be uh, racing. But just finally, at what point did your group know that it was impossible to catch the trio? Um, I don't know. We were working quite well until 2k to go, to be honest. But I kind of knew maybe four or five k to go, we went. They, they they pulled out on us. So they're pulling out on us on this last part. Then. Uh, yeah, we're not bringing that back unless they were looking at each other. But you know, after yesterday, I think these guys, uh, yeah, you know, Mate and Asgreen, they they know how to uh, to win from a break. I don't, I don't think they would mess around for too long at the finish.